Hi everyone and welcome back. We're heading into episode 7 of My Day. I think this is where the, the competition part of it starts. I've been looking forward to this part because, of course, this is what the company does. And it's about food. And we're going to see how well they do. We're also seeing Ace and Sky get even closer. Everyone knows they're attracted to one another. It's pretty obvious. Having them admit their feelings, though, to one another. Or well, let's just see if they do that. It feels like that's where it's heading in the next couple of episodes. It's pretty obvious. I even think to them that they have feelings. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share. Chef Manny, how are Hi, Ace. I'm here with pictures. <laughs> yes, good morning. Oh, okay, that's good to hear. But I have Not something for you, because your neck is you. broken. Don't uh, worry, because you know, yesterday, I was here in the kitchen. And unfortunately, I broke my neck. Medyo nakabrace nga ako ngayon if you'll see me eh. I hope you understand. Uh, Talagang ano eh, parang hindi ko yata yeah, kaya no mag-participate in my condition right now. Ano? <laughs> Alam mo, hindi yata kaya talaga even if I want to. Um, I'm in pain and uh, I just don't want to drag you guys down. broken neck. Sorry ah. Parang hindi makaka-attend, Chef. Okay na, settle na lahat. I wish I could do something about this, pero hindi talaga kaya is. I, I hope you understand. Okay, Chef. Well, Sorry, isn't Sky down. a good chef? Hindi pwede si Chef eh. Oh, ano ba yan? Grasyo siya. Kung paano yan? Wala tayong share. Diyan ang kailangan natin ng options. Oh, kaya na ako prepare, no? Sunok mo, malalabi tayo sa daddy mo yan. Yan pa naman yung tao na unahan na pinigay sa iyong responsibilidad dito. Oh wait, he's got an idea. Teka, may naisip ako. Di ba pero sumali tayo ng ano, kay competition sa school? Nanahal tayo nun dahil sa'yo, di ba? Dinner ka namin nun. Oh, pwede siya yung pumalit. Sir Ace, kaya niya. So you just put even more pressure on him. Kaya niya yun. Kaya niya Sky. Di ba top notch ka sa school? Oh my god! Talaga Sky! Top ka? Why? Nakaka-excite! Top sa Sky! Top siya! Teka, teka guys! Teka! Medyo malaking competition to ah! Pero Sir Ace, dream na dream ko talaga to para makapasok sa competition na to. Sir Ace, nasa sa inyo po yung decision. I mean, I don't eat cakes and stuff like that to doesn't appeal to me. Um, yeah, here comes the flirting. Did he just kiss his ear? I mean, okay. Right? When did this happen? And in front of everyone's salad too? No, it's not for the company, it's for your man. <laughs> Nerves sometimes can be a good thing. I feel like this is, has double meaning to it. It's almost like he's telling him it's okay for them to be together. I think I know you. No, not you. Yeah, get out of my way. Oh my god! I'm oh, sorry. Ace? Uh. Sorry, I'm going to Si Bench, Torres. Oh, Bench! Of the deepness of the voice. Oh my god! 
ang ganda mo, bitch! Thank you, product of art and science! Seryoso mo, bitch, grabe, ang ganda mo, tinalo mo. It's been a long time. Oh my god, bitch. Ah, this is Kai. Ah, this is... Hi. So you must be Mr. Philippines. Yes po. Wow, good luck. Good luck to all of you here. By the way, I'm celebrating my birthday next week. Why don't you join me at the club? Ah, kailan yun? Next week, Monday. Ah, sige ah. Message ka na lang. Alright, ready to party? Thank you so much. Maliit yung bagay. Kailan ka dito? Ah, mga three months ago. Wow. How are you? Ah, I'm doing good. I'm medyo kinakapan ako for this competition, pero naniniwala ako. Well, you have to make it. Okay, thank you. Ano ang mga dito? Post ka ba? No, I'm actually judging the competition. Bench, baka naman. No, 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 no. You have to make the Filipinos proud. By the way, I couldn't even talk to you nga eh. So, galingan mo na lang ha. Siyempre, ako ba ba? Alright, good luck to you. See you later, Bench. Yeah, they're not actually allowed to speak to you. Okay, so di kaya kamahal ako ka na. Talaga. Ano, ready ka na? Tingnan natin yung tawag nila. This is it, Pansit. Para sa pandigya mo. Hindi, para sa atin ito. Para sa kumpanya, para sa inyo. Yeah, it's free trouble. Yun nga, siguro. Okay guys, so let's prepare ourselves. We're about to start in 10 minutes, so please proceed to the stage. This way, please. Hindi nga, kaya na. Wait a minute. Now! Come on, go Sky. <laughs> and you, Mr. Judge? Oh, wait, there was another judge there. Oh, the mom's watching. <laughs> Good day, everyone. Welcome to the biggest big competition in the world. This is Peaks of the World 2020. It's going to be really, really exciting. We have 48 kids from all over the world coming here to Manila, Philippines to wow. claim the grand prize. 48. At this point, let's get to know all of our candidates. Ah. Even though they're all Filipino actors. <laughs> These are just reactors now that they put in. <laughs> Let's talk about the criteria for judging. Here we go. Originality, that's 20%. Difficulty, 25%. Creativity, 20%. Okay. Technique use is 20%. General appearance, 15%. For a total of 100%. Let's get to meet That's the judges whose job of I do not envy for downs. today. Starting off with a socialite and owner of Mega Kitchen Wares, Benj Sanchez. We have with us multi-awarded international chef, Andre King. And finally, we have producer of Cakes of the World, Stephen Yu. <laughs> so Candace, <laughs> I can't get over this bit of reaction. Let's start with the competition. <laughs> I 
I love the designs that people have. My my cousin is amazing at cakes. They made me a tennis one. I don't eat cake, but it was nice. Everyone is rooting for you. Um, you can't actually do that in a competition. I mean, their cakes are there, so you know. Congratulations! Let's bring on in Indonesia. Aggressive much? Let's add to what we have here. Brazil, come on down. Slot left, and that slot belongs to He's such a straight guy. It's been a truly exciting year for Cakes of the World. And we'd like to thank all the families who's given a round of applause for participating in the truly exciting and very tasty. But at this point, it's time to announce who will take home the top prize. Yep. Let's start out with our third runner up. Are they gonna make Sky the runner up? I wonder if it's Brazil or Indonesia. Third runner up is Brazil! <laughs> It was like, I've never seen Game of Thrones, but it sounds like that music. Japan! Really? Okay, I thought Indonesia would have been next. I don't mention will be the first runner up. So here we go. No, no, yeah. Oh, 
Hey, you were second place, and... Uh. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Fakes of the World 2020 has come to an end. Let's see you all next year, and remember... I would have flipped Indonesia and Japan over. Oh, he's crying. Uh, but you kind of gathered they weren't going to win. It was made pretty obvious. You could just tell by the editing. He's laughing. But again, I would have switched Japan and Indonesia around. Dramatic music. He is really kind to him. You're so, so good. Thank you. Does he have a rat tail at the back of his hair? Huh? Yeah, he does. Well, who else could do it? You can't blame Sky. I mean, the chef did break his neck. He just did. Yeah, well, you never really cared for your son. That's pretty obvious. Seeing as you just reappeared. Is that rat tail? It's true, you can make mistakes. Wow, someone has control issues and an ego.
Ano ba talagang dapat kong gawin? Isn't he really young as well? Bakit hindi niyo po kaya tanggapin ang pagkatalo? Bakit? Ano ba meron kayong dalawa? Ha? Ano ba meron sa inyong dalawa? Dad, wala po. Nung wala! Kung makapagtanggol ka, wakas! Dad, wala po kasi siyang kasalanan. Kasusunod ah. Ayaw na ayaw ko nang makikita yan pagkukuha na yan dito sa opisina natin. Okay, ah, blah, 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 blah. Ang dami yan. Maayos na. You can't blame the intern, it's so ridiculous. Well, we know he's going to see him again, because it's not the end. This is what a father like that does to you. He takes away all of your confidence. He just got fired. They have a dog now? to say about this episode was manic it was very chaotic when did they get a dog did i just miss that the whole time uh the farmer's overreaction to coming in second place that I, I i mean i get it companies do want to win and they can get very frustrated if you don't but he still was in the top two which highlights that they're very good at what they do most companies would actually be proud because it means that people will still see the company and know that they're good. I do like that they use reactors for people representing different countries because I've seen, I haven't watched their reaction channels, but I have seen them pop up on my main page. <laughs> so that was kind of funny to see that. And also because I only got mentioned, I think one of them recently, so to see them was like, oh, this person was mentioned to me. It was also interesting that they use Filipino actors to represent the other countries but I guess it's also to do with budget and how this is filmed. It's very farcic. It is all over the place. It's like a dramatic soap opera with a lot of comedy in it. Uh, a lot of product placement. Those were quite funny to see. They just pop in. Uh, it is very disjointed how it's filmed. I mean those two guys apologize after they have that dream and then switching back and forth. But it, I am enjoying the show, but it is a lot to take in at points. Of course, we're finally getting Sky and Ace probably next episode amid their feelings. I don't know what's going to happen about Sky's internship because the dad doesn't want him there. That was a bit confusing why he would blame the intern. Wouldn't you blame the son? And then you call him a failure and everything. This is why your son has issues because you're not a good dad with your rat tail. Oh, I hate rat tails. It was just a bit strange, he appears and then yells and... Also, when they did the product placement for the sauce, and they were sitting there, they were conversing. I, it's definitely hard for the actors because they go on quite long the scenes, so they're improv in a lot, which actually is a great skill to have, so congratulations to them on that because that actually is pretty hard. When they were preparing the cakes, when they were practicing and they were flirting in front of everyone, I mean, literally, they were about to kiss in front of everyone. Uh, be careful what you're doing, guys. It's still a workplace. In your case now, it won't be because you're kind of integrated into one another's lives. But the actors are doing a good job because 
they're allowing as all we're allowed to see them grow as the show goes along and then navigating where their characters are going to uh again it's just very chaotic uh and i i don't know i didn't i like the episode i thought we were going to get a bit more of the competition but it's pretty hard to do that in this type of show because they have a formula that they follow which may not seem like it but it's there's a formula yeah i'm looking forward to what happens in the next episode i think it's it's starting to pick up i think the last few episodes have really picked up on where they want to go at least but it just was so funny listening to them talk about ace and sky while eating is it prawn crackers i think thank you for watching and i will be back next week with episode eight